Hello to all my LTYG people. I received a question from one of you which inspired me to film this three-part series on the topic of perfectionism. You are all such an inspiration to me, so a huge thanks for all of your feedback, questions, and wonderful comments. I just love receiving them. If you'd like to continue receiving healing and gut-related information, please like and subscribe to the LTYG channel. In my first video, I touched a bit on creativity in one's healing, as healing requires a lot of out-of-the-norm perspectives. In the second video, I talked about when to change protocols and the best times to introduce new products and supplements into your routine to most minimize any negative effects. If you missed either of these, I will link them both in the video description below for you. In this third and final video, I'd like to discuss the subject of fear and how fear can hinder your healing. Addressing the emotional component or fear surrounding chronic illness is so crucial. Make it your aim to release the fear from past experiences like I personally had to, to break away from stagnancy in your healing journey. Jeannie has a wonderful laser tapping session on releasing emotions in the gut that are causing physical symptoms, which you can try for yourself for free, and I'll link the details in the video description below for you because I highly, highly recommend it. If you've watched my Healing in Layers video, you'll have seen all the different symptoms and emotions which arose for me during my healing journey and how I had to address each symptom and emotion layer by layer. And if you haven't seen it, I'll link it below for you as well. For each layer I addressed, I had to adjust my protocol. So I hope you can see the importance of being open to change as needed. In the meantime, work on releasing fear and building self-confidence so you can know and feel secure in making your healthcare decisions. And as I mentioned previously, if you need additional support in this regard, you can reference all of Jeannie's home remedy pages, her books, and the professionals she suggests who are familiar with all of her protocols. And I'll link all relevant information for you in the video description below. Now, when it comes to health and listening to your body, I truly feel there are no mistakes. Even if a supposed mistake occurs, there's always a lesson you could take away from the experience. If your current protocol is working, that's fantastic. Jeannie offers so many different protocols depending on your symptoms, so keep on trucking and whatever you decide, don't let yourself be held back by fear. Stay tuned as I'm currently working on a series of videos about how to listen to your gut, which I hope can further assist you in learning how to tune into your body and specifically what it needs. Well, I hope the information I've shared with you over the course of these three videos can help you break away from the idea of perfectionism and move in to a place of resilience and power so you can find the protocol that fits you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the LTYG channel if you haven't already. And as always, Happy healing to everyone, and remember always listen to your gut. Mm -hmm.